Hello everybody, my name is Brian Capitao and I am the founder and owner of The Freeze, also known as DeepFreezeChillin.com. Uh, started as a podcast back in 2015 and has grown into a blog and has eventually kind of become its own sort of like music magazine dealing with hip hop and specifically with feature length uh, articles. So uh, I am a journalist and I am both a journalist and a content creator based in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Uh, and basically what I would like is the website eventually kind of spawning into this own uh, kind of media company helping promote music journalists and dealing with hip in the hip hop space in uh, Toronto and in, in, in Toronto in, in particular, uh, maybe who knows in the future, uh, will feature artists across Canada. We have reviewed artists um, in Montreal and in Calgary, for example, but right now the focus is in, in Toronto, locally where it's, where it's based, um, as well as, you know, talking about the bigger U.S. artists as well. So, uh, this video here, basically we are starting a crowd uh, funding campaign in order to help with the financing of equipment as the purchase of media equipment can get pretty pricey. I've had to basically bootstrap the business um, pretty much the entire time. Um, so I'm just asking if people can help and contribute to this as we continue to grow. And hopefully, eventually, 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 I would eventually like to hire writers, hire video editors, hire you know the whole nine yards eventually if the company grows right but that's a very big if um so like i said i have bootstrap in the past and i have purchased equipment in the past so for example we i've been doing the the podcast with this uh road mic for the past five to six years and i've only just recently basically purchased a shock mount because it was getting pretty annoying in the edits uh as well and i had to replace the pop filter as the the pop filter that it comes with could not uh, fit in the little shock mount here. So that's like one thing. Another thing is like a video tripod that I recently bought. Uh, been needing a video tripod for a couple of years now. Uh, I have one for still photography that's behind me as well. So like I said, I've been purchasing equipment just little by little over the years. And now I'm just putting it out to you, the audience, if you could help uh, with the purchase of equipment in order for the podcast and the website to grow.